everyone, I'm Janet with Radiant Realty, your Montana realtor. Thank you so much for joining me. Today we are going to check out the five top lakes in West Kalispell and even beyond into Kyla and Marion for lakefront homes and properties. Montana is home to so many beautiful lakes and I'm excited to share the specific amenities of these five with you. So let's get going. But before we do, if you are new to the channel, thank you so much for joining me. Please do hit that subscribe button and stay a while. If you are looking to buy or sell a property or home here in Montana, definitely reach out. I would be honored to help you with that. And if you do find anything in here helpful or useful, please do give a big thumbs up. It really helps me out. All right, let's get going. Just 20 miles southwest of downtown Kalispell, you will find Rogers Lake. A small lake tucked away from the busyness of life. This lake is known for kayaking, boating, paddleboarding, and fishing. It is home to cutthroat trout and arctic grayling. Finding a home or property on Rogers Lake might require some patience. This 239 acre lake has less than 50 properties to choose from with nearly half of those on state leased land. But as the saying goes, good things come to those who wait. Let's take a look at one of the Rogers Lake listings from 2022. This was for one of the state leased land homes. It was a one bedroom, one bathroom. If you are looking into a state leased land purchase, it's just for the improvements. So it's something you definitely want to talk to further with your real estate agent and really make sure you have a clear understanding before getting into it. That said, because the land is leased, um, you can get something a lot more affordably um, as you see here with that $140,000 price point. However, you will have that monthly lease fee for the land on top of that. And coming in at number four is McGregor Lake. McGregor Lake is part of the Thompson Chain of Lakes, which is a 20 mile stretch along Highway 2 that includes access to 18 lakes. The lake is just under 1,500 acres in size. And although much of the surrounding shoreline is owned by the state, one can still find an opportunity for private ownership. There is even a gated community for your consideration on this lake. Water activities include fishing, water skiing, I even saw some scuba divers while I was there, swimming and boating. While residents can also enjoy nearby access to snowmobile and ATV trails, hiking and cross country ski trails, and public hunting acreage. This is the furthest of the five lakes from the city of Kalispell, sitting 30 miles southwest of the city, but is accessed mostly by paved roads. Let's take a look at just a few of the McGregor Lake listings from 2021 and 2022. This one here is a two bed, two bath and is currently available. It's listed for just under a million dollars. And then let's just take a look at a few that have sold in the last year or two as well. Coming in at number three is Little Bitterroot Lake. The Little Bitterroot is just under 3,000 acres and offers a few more opportunities for private ownership around the lake. The lake has a variety of older cottages mixed with some newly built and updated homes. This lake is beautiful and peaceful, offering homeowners a plethora of activities to choose from without an excess of crowds. Little Bitterroot Lake is about 25 miles southwest of downtown Kalispell. So let's take a look at a few of the Little Bitterroot Lake listings from 2021 and 2022. This one is currently active. It's a two bedroom, one bath home for just $1.3 million. It is under contract, but gives a good idea of what homes are going for. And let's take a look at a few that have recently sold as well. And coming in at number two is Ashley Lake. Ashley Lake is known for its turquoise waters and holds the title of the second cleanest lake in the entire state of Montana. The lake is just over 3,000 acres in size and sits 25 miles from the city of Kalispell. This lake is accessed quite a ways down a dirt road and is surrounded by forest land. Ashley Lake will have a bit more activity than Rogers Lake or the Little Bitterroot as many local fishermen frequent the waters for fly fishing, ice fishing, jigging, trolling, and more. If fishing isn't your fancy, there are plenty of other activities along the lake for your enjoyment as well. Um, let's take a look at just a few of the Ashley Lake listings from 2021 and 2022. 
This one is currently active. It's absolutely gorgeous. I will put a link in the description box below for any of these that are still active. It is $25 million, but it is over 8,000 square feet of just absolute impeccable finishes on this one it's kind of created to reflect a european type lodge and it's just absolutely gorgeous let's take a look at a few others that have closed this year as well it might not have cost quite that much money And coming in at number one this week is Foy's Lake. Due to its close proximity, just three miles west of Kalispell on a paved road, paired with its beautiful aqua blue color, Foy's Lake comes in as number one. This lake can get quite busy in summer with local swimmers and sun enthusiasts, but Foy's Lake offers residents opportunities for fishing, boating, water skiing, paddle boarding, kayaking, ice fishing, and so much more. Technically, there are three Foy's Lakes, Upper, Middle, and Lower. The Lower Foy's Lake is the one we are referencing today. A few homes can be found on Middle Foy's Lake, while Upper Foy's Lake doesn't have any waterfront properties. Residents can also enjoy hiking and biking the nearby Lone Pine State Park, Heron Park, and the Foy's to Blacktail Trails. So let's take a look at the few of the Foy's Lake listings from 2021 and 2022. This three bedroom two bath is still available and active. I will put a link below for $1,050,000. And then let's just scroll through a few that have recently sold. today i would love to hear in the comments below which was your favorite of the five leaks this week do hit that notification bell so you get notified when new videos drop next week we are going to head on up to whitefish and west glacier and have an amazing week and i will see you all next time mm -hmm.